Okay, you done. Welcome to another lecture. A 48 years old motorcyclist sustains a complex dual limb fracture in motorcycle accident. For a time, the popliteal artery is occluded and eventually will create. Subsequently, he develops a compartment syndrome. The anterior and superficial posterior compartment of the leg are decompressed. Unfortunately, the operative surgeon neglected the de decompress the deep posterior compartment, which of the following muscle is least likely to be affected as a result. So it is one of the long question. So after careful reading, now we have to find out the key point of this person. Here we can see a 48 years old motorcyclist and he undergone complex lower limb uh, fracture in the motorcycle accident a popliteal artery was occluded and repaired but after death he developed compartment syndrome so from here this point is important first of all compartment syndrome the anterior and superficial posterior compartment of the lower leg are decompressed but unfortunately the operating surgeon neglect to decompress the posterior deep compartment so the deep posterior compartment muscle function will be compromised or this muscle will be injured which of the following muscle is least likely to be affected as a result so it is now clear that the the deep posterior compartment will be affected and we have to find out which is not a muscle of the deep posterior compartment because the deep posterior compartment will be affected and least affected that means the not affected that means which muscle is not lies in the deep posterior compartment of the leg so here are the options options are flexor digitor longus plantaris tibialis posterior flexor hollosis longus and none of the above so we have to find out one of the muscle which is not located in the deep posterior compartment of the leg so here you can see this is the posterior compartment of the leg and here we can see the different muscle first of all in the first box and this is the superficial group of the muscle in the posterior compartment of the leg and the lower box it is the deep compartment of the leg so here first of all we can see the superficial muscles of the posterior compartment of the leg first of all here we can see the gastrocnemius soleus and plantaris so gastrocnemius soleus and plantaris they are the superficial compartment of the posterior compartment of the leg then we can see here there are the deep posterior compartment muscle and in this compartment there are different type of muscles such as the flexor digitor of longus flexor hollosis longus tbl is posterior and popliteus in this here we can see this is the deep group of the muscle in the posterior compartment so in the leg the deep group of posterior compartment muscle here they are in the upper part here we can see this is the popliteus which is located very close to the popliteal fossa or it is from the base of the popliteal fossa then we can see this muscle this is the tibialis posterior here flexor digitorum longus and here we can see the flexor hollosis longus so these four muscle they are the muscle group located into deep compartment of the uh, deep group of the posterior compartment so here we can see the superficial posterior compartment it contains gastrocnemia soleus and plantaris and all it is supplied by the tibial nerve actually the all the posterior group muscle are supplied by the tibial nerve and here the deep posterior compartment here we can see the flexor digitorum longus flexor hollosis longus tbl is posterior and popliteus muscle and all the posterior muscle are supplied by this nerve this is nerve is the tbl nerve so our final answer is now ready that the plantaris because plantaris is the superficial deep compartment muscle on the other hand we can see the flexor digitorum longus it is a deep compartment muscle tbl is posterior is also the deep compartment muscle and flexor hollosis longus they are also the deep compartment muscle and deep compartment muscle will be compromised and in this question they want to know least likely that means which is not content of the deep posterior compartment here yeah, this is the plantaris because plantaris is the superficial group of the muscle uh, with other two muscles such as the gastrocnemius and soleus thank you all